Hey guys, what's up? It's AAA Battery, and welcome back to more Paper Mario the Thousand Year Door. In the last episode, we got to this garden and, well... We went and fought Gloomtail, the last of the dragons that the Shadow Queen had. In this episode, we're gonna explore this area. See these chime chomps? Throw Bob Ray into them? And a pipe appears. Travel down it. Hit the switch. It's a boat panel. Same over here. Let's go ahead and hit them. And here. So then, now that we have access, because now we know we have to use boat to the boat mode. But it actually access that area. What do you say we actually do that? If you have a really lonely road, huh? It's just the eight of us. How could there be such a huge tower on the ground? And why was it built? There seems to be a lot of rooms here, and every one contains a riddle. Welcome to the Riddle Tower! This area, every single door must be cleared for you to actually progress, by the way. Beyond, beyond, beyond. Complete all seven before, before. So yeah, this is probably the one you're intending to go to first. There's, a, there's something written on the wall. Based on the message, I'd say, that word beyond probably refers to away from the door. So that means the left block. So then the word before must refer to the right block. Are you with me, Mario? So the way they repeat those words must have some meaning too, don't you think? Yeah. Goombella actually is pretty effective for hints here if you get stuck because... This probably won't be the most obvious answer you could conclude. Of course, the thinking power also goes a long way too. Don't be afraid to use your own brain. Yeah, that chest just came from the shadows and a palace key was inside of it. Let's check out some of these other doors right now. Unseen may yet be felt, so that we, the Great Ones, be it here or be it there. Unseen. We can still feel it. Flurry can be useful for this. You see that? With a palace key! It's time to get Flurry's help for this one. Yeah, that room felt way too small. Another chest comes from the shadows. All you see isn't all there be. Stone the power of stars. Touch it to pass through it. Another palace key.
This music actually sounds pretty similar to the pit of one of the trials. Now this one. Four stones, twin stones. Master of shadow and dark. Two are one, one is two. You know these are metal blocks also. The stone ones can be broken, but the metal ones, no. This hammer actually got nerfed quite a bit in Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door because in the original Paper Mario, you actually could destroy these with your Ultra Hammer, but you can't here. And this is the only time they appear also. You can't do anything else in this room though, so... Yeah. We just have to continue. Let's go up this staircase. Bones. Let, let fall the weakest, and let the skies lie, then build to the strongest. The weakest, the dull bones. Next, the red bones. Then the dry bones. And finally, the dark bones. And once that's done... Another block. And yet another palace key. Again, all these blocks. And I'll destroy this one and that one. Straight on, straight onward. You know the stars burn us. Destroy all in your path. Get Bobbery? Blow the wall up. In this, that is a very specific spot. And yet another palace key can be found. The shy one hides his shape, but the stars bring balance. The shy one hides his face. Yeah. If you're wondering, you actually need to use Vivian's Veil to find it, because the block will come to light once you actually are not there. The block is shy. But I already knew where it was, so whatever. Now we only do have six out of eight keys. What you're supposed to do? Go back down. And now this block is available for us to break. And this block can be hit. Got a palace key. And another block can be hit here. Final key. Huh. 
Oh boy. At the very top. Mario, look there! What's this infernal contraption? It's absolutely titanic. What in blazes is it? The star soul we found in Gloomtail's room? Let's put it inside. There are eight of them. So, we can start them all. Okay, guys, we'll go over there. And now this starts up. Woo! It's moving! That we can no longer enter Gloomtail's room. What was that? All that being done. Let's head downwards. Get out of this water. And venture forth. Now. There's another mini boss coming up. Would you believe it? Yeah. So we're gonna go ahead and just save our game. We're having Vivian out specifically for this because you see why. You'll understand all too well as well, I feel. I've been waiting for you, Mario. Huh? Professor Frankly, what are you doing here? Thank you so much for opening the door for us, Mario. Yes, that was nice. Thanks to your do-good and predictability, my plan is progressing very smoothly. Plan? Sis? How dare you? And what do you mean about us opening the door for you? <laughs> so you still don't see it? Ah, such fools. The professor, frankly, you were with when you opened the thousand-year door was none other than this little freak in a sheet! Uh, yeah, my name's Duplass, but... <laughs> the real Frankly is sleeping off a nasty bump on head in a closet somewhere. You assaulted Frankly! Oh. Poor thing. And once we get rid of you here, our plan will be nearly complete. Ready for the end, my dears? You and the traitor Vivian have a date with eternity! Uh -huh. That's right, Slick. Eternity! Shut up, freak! Oh, okay. Right. Sorry. Is this routine with you guys? I'm with Mario all the way. Today, sis, I'm going to punish you, you hear me? Come, my sort of lovelies. Marilyn, Vivi- Freak in a sheet! 
I have this thing on me. Gah. I said my name's Dupless! Yeah, the Shadow Sirens and freaking the Sheets. Alright, my kind of lovelies. This time we take out Mario and his Goon Squad for good. So, if I catch you slacking, we'll be in for incredible punishment coming tomorrow. Gah! Okay, 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 okay. Yeah, this fight is interesting to say the least. We've already had them back in Botley Woods and in the Creepy Steeple, so we don't have that to worry about. Um, yeah. They're actually much stronger than they have been before, though. They actually have gained some new abilities, and likely we'll be seeing a lot of them as we go into this fight, so I'll leave them to demonstrate. They don't need me to influence you, so you how impressive they've gotten. We're gonna start off by doing for a spring jump on the ringleader. Look at that damage output. Hey, why, hey, hey, yes. And Vivian, you're gonna go for your attack too, then. As you can see, they're. Gah! Curse you, Mario. This is so very annoying. Blast it! Mm -hmm. Yeah, freaking if she's gonna do his own dive bomb attack, but. That doesn't really do much. Man. I swore I pressed the A button, but I guess it didn't work. Man, that throws us so. Yeah, we're in for good danger. Oh, Dupless, you're gonna go for your copy ability again, are you? Copying Vivian. Just like old times, huh? What do you miss? Last chances for attacker are all available. Well, I'm already frozen, it doesn't really matter. So Mario's turn has been skipped right now, as you see. Yeah, Bell didn't have some new ability. He can actually. No, she can actually prevent you from attacking um, multiple times in a turn. That's nice. That's, that's really nice. So that means that Mario can't actually do anything. And, yeah, I. I don't think that this takes much repeating. It really doesn't, I think. So we're gonna go ahead and just... Well, first of all, we have to make sure that Mario can actually survive the next few turns. And I have plenty of Ultra Shrooms, so I'm gonna go ahead and use one right now to keep the help the heal him. We really don't need Vivian for much here. I, do want to actually, I actually want to have more of my party invested. Okay, that's not really the best option you can have, but... Uh -oh. Yeah, that didn't work for you. No damage. Nope. They missed. And, yeah, you can give yourself more chances to attack, too. Like, Masha Grubba could, as well. You know, this actually feels really weird having to fight Miss Mouse. She's been so cool this entire game. Uh, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and bring Riki out for this. And we're gonna go for the power lift, because we gotta have our ourselves being able to do a lot of damage up right now. We don't wanna get anywhere here. That was almost synchronized with the music. Alright, you got plus four defense and plus four attack. And now we're going to summon a Stampede to cut the Crusher into bits. Now look at this damage, it's going to be amazing. The Yoshis are coming back. The Yoshis are coming. <laughs> I'll eat the rest of you. And that's it. Oh, you're copying Riki now. You buster! Uh oh. I just remembered I had defense up. Uh oh, you're charging your stats now. Oh, that could be broad. Could be broad. Yes, broad with a nice slide of marmalade. And it... what am I talking about? <laughs> I don't know anymore. Yeah, we got a mushroom! That's that's nice. It's actually really nice. Uh, let me give that to Riki, actually, because I needed something to heal him, but I didn't want to use something too 
I didn't want to use too much for him at the same time. So that's actually a pretty handy thing. In the meantime, we're gonna go for my hole. I hurt. Isn't it? Nope. <laughs> that did nothing. Oh shoot. That did 10 damage. Wow. Okay. You can already tell we're already pretty close to the fight finishing this fight. I'm, I'm kind of just playing with him at this point. This is this is not a threat. This really isn't. God. Yeah, you're done here. We're done. Oh no. And it's so close to a level up, too. Oh, that makes me feel sad. Uh, at this rate, she will never. Oh. Uh. Uh, seeing stars. I'm looking at constellations, if anything. And because I feel like a jerk, I'm gonna fight this Jane Chop, too. <laughs> I had some hair on my lip, too. That's, that's nasty. Um, <laughs> next time we made Mario at a thousand year door, we're going to be continuing during the, um, to the Palace of Shadow. We're on the home stretch. I'll see you guys next time.